Today I'm going to show you how to connect a Raza X instance that you have up and running to an assistant that you're hosting on GitHub. I have my Raza X instance here. I'm logged into my instance and I want to add an assistant that I already have on GitHub. It is important that your assistant is set up so that uh, the domain, credentials, config, uh, endpoint actions, all of those files are in the first level of your repository. If these are in another folder, say called Moonbot Plus, uh, it won't work. So I'm going to go down here to this thing that says not connected currently and then connect to a repository. And here I have some information. So this SSH key, don't worry, will not be in use by the time this video airs, but you do want to keep this secret. And I'm going to connect these two to each other. So first of all, I need the SSH URL in my GitHub repository. Here under this drop down, you can see clone with SSH and here is my SSH URL. And then the target branch, if you look here, you will see that I only have a master branch currently in this repo, so I'm gonna use that. And then I need to take this SSH uh, deploy key to your remote Git repository. So I'm gonna copy that. Here in your assistance repo, you want to go to settings deploy keys. You can see I currently don't have any deploy keys. I'm going to add a deploy key here, just paste it in, and I'm going to call this Raza X, and then I'm going to allow write access so I can push changes to my assistant from my Raza X instance to this repository and add the key. Uh, now that this has all been set up, I'm going to verify connection. All right, and now we have a repository connected. So that's how you connect a GitHub repository to a virtual assistant based on Raza X.